Yo, what's going on guys? Gemini here back with another video. Unfortunately today it's not a banger video because I'm not in the highest of spirits right now given the fact of how Warzone Mobile is performing on my high-end device even after Season 6 update, multiple updates. Um, initially when the update dropped, both iOS and Android users were having major game-breaking issues. Namely, mainly, I should say, the gyro bug and they did release an update that fixed it and i've been getting a lot of reports from ios users specifically phone users the latest models iphone 15 series that the game is running smooth you know excellent on their device no fps drops no gyro bugs none of those issues i was hoping that it would be the same for android but unfortunately that's not the case when the update dropped yesterday on android i was having a lot of frame drops I, after multiple restarts, multiple resets, it, it was the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Having a lot of bugs, having a lot of issues. And as you can see right here, these are my graphic settings. It, it's pretty low. Everything is low except for that, which is high. You know, so I can see at distance. But yeah, I don't, I don't see why they should be affecting my gameplay because this is what I was playing on before. And I used to get over 100 stable FPS. You know what I'm saying? But all of a sudden, like... I'm dropping to like 40 FPS during a gunfight, as you can see in this clip right here. As you guys saw that, like, this is crazy. Like, look at this. Like, why am I dropping from 100 plus FPS, the high 100s, to like 40 plus FPS, bro? Like, it's crazy, man. Like, it shouldn't be happening, you know, less than 50 sometimes. Sometimes I'll just be running in the open. Nothing is happening, no activities. And I'm just dropping frames, lagging all over, you know. And the lag is different from the frame drops because I'll be having like 100 plus FPS and still lagging, like my game just hitching, you know, constantly hitching. And I don't know why. My device is cooled. I make sure that my device is cooled. I play in a cool environment, you know. I have a very powerful cooler, but doesn't doesn't do anything. It seems, you know, what I'm saying still overheating if you don't have the the proper cooling method. I did make a video on that. Still overheats your device, trust me. And I was playing on max performance on my device. You know, set my phone to max performance. Now, this is the most powerful gaming phone out there, the Red Magic 9 Pro, currently. You know, but yeah, it's I don't know, man. It's it's just crazy, bro. Like I I couldn't enjoy the game. I couldn't enjoy the game. Got a few dubs, but it was a struggle. Dropping from 100 plus FPS to 40 FPS during a gunfight literally determines the outcome of that gunfight. And it's most of the times, it's always me coming out with a loss. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, it literally messes with your entire sensitivity because I dial my sensitivity for 100 FPS and above. Like, you know, if it drops to the 90s, the high 90s, I'll be good and 120 fov i can toggle between 120 or 115 fov based off how i'm feeling you know if i feel more comfortable at that point i'll do that but during a gunfight i dropped from like what 100 high 100 to like 40 fps bro that's criminal not even 60 fps chat not even 60 fps guys like 40 plus fps shouldn't be happening in the game you know what i'm saying that doesn't make any sense on a high-end device Android or iOS, that just shouldn't be happening, man. And I personally think that it has to do something with Texas streaming. And I know you guys are going to say, oh, yo, Gemini, you need to get better internet for that. Take a look at my internet. I'm going to brag right now just to show you guys that my internet is actually really good right now. You know what I'm saying? I have like one gigabit fiber internet. You know what I'm saying? And obviously, like, I'm far from the servers, you know, so... Like the closest server I think is in Florida. I think that's the closest server that we have. And that's even farther for us because even with one gigabit internet, um, I'm still getting like 50 plus MS, 60 plus MS because it, it's not going to go lower than that. doesn't matter how much faster internet is. It's just a distance between you, your device, or your ISP and the servers. So you have to be pinging to different locations. And it's just annoying because like there's a lot of caribbean players in in in, in the game in cod mobile cod mobile has close very close servers to us 
you know, we are getting good ping, you know, in COD Mobile. Like, I even get 20, low 20s in COD Mobile. But in Warzone Mobile, like, doesn't drop below 40, like, below 50. And crazy, man. Like, that coupled with the fact that we have to be Texas streaming, so annoying, bro. It literally affects the entire gameplay. It literally affects the entire outcome of my gunfights, everything. And this is just me ranting right now because I, I literally don't know what else to do. I can't do anything. It's not my device, not my internet. It's just a game. And right now, I don't know what to do, bro. Like, the only solution that I have right now to actually, like, fix this kind of is to get the iphone 16 pro max which has a 6.9 inch display the reason why i haven't been playing on my 14 pro max is because it has a small screen screen is too small bro my hands are huge i have huge hands you know what i'm saying i don't have baby hands my hands are huge and i'll be playing on a 6.8 inch device which was the red magic 7 pro and to recalibrate my fingers and all that, it's got, it literally hurts my fingers to play on a smaller device, you know. So I have to play on a large device. I have the same size device as the Red Magic Seven Pro, which is why I got the Red Magic Nine Pro because it's powerful, same size, everything, height to temperate, right? But now the iPhone is coming out with a six point nine inch display, W, even slightly bigger than the red magic and very powerful chipset great graphics and as we all know iphone takes precedence over everything else in gaming when it comes to optimization so looking forward to that that's the only solution right now and yeah i don't know when that's gonna pull through because iphone is not gonna be released for now so i still have a, a bit of waiting to do so until then i really don't know what to do bro <laughs> i don't know man I, I really don't know what to do. If you guys have any such a suggestions, leave them in the comment section. Yeah. I don't know. I'm lost right now. It is. Do have yourself a wonderful rest of the day, guys. Take care of yourself. Take care of your family. Enemy dropping into the AO. Dropping into the AO. Yeah. 
Okay. 